are you? All right, we are gonna do a why it didn't work out with you and your person, the issues, what went wrong, etc. with the news is on it, and maybe what you could do to fix it if that comes out, if you even give a shit about fixing it. So that's totally up to you, okay? Okay, so, mm, we're gonna start off by using my what went wrong oracle deck which you can find in my etsy shop link in bio boom let's give it a cleanse Rainy night, last night. i love me some mariah last night i dreamed that i whispered i loved you Ooh, maybe you're dreaming about your ex or your ex is dreaming about you all right, we got a few of them here. It says, not very good in the bedroom, kind of embarrassing. Wow. Somebody doesn't feel like they're really good in the bedroom. Or maybe it's like they don't care about like finishing you off and they just care about their own pleasure. It's like, okay, I'm finished. Screw you. I'm just going to leave you there, you know, and he... <laughs> Maybe that's what I'm channeling. It's not that they're not good in bed. You know, they got a good, you know, whether you're male or female watching. It's just that when one person finishes, it's, you live the other person high and dry. And it's like, you're just filled with all these hormones that haven't been released. And this is why you always fight. So and somebody was always disappointed because of that. Like, hello, what about me? Poisoning your food later on. No. And then we also have double dating and trying to share each other. What? Maybe you guys are like party animals or whatever. Somebody here was always trying to like share each other's partner. Or like if you took a friend and their friend took a friend, you guys ended up like exchanging lovers or like there was always flirting with the other person while they were in front of you. And that became an issue. Like the people you party with, they got a little too close to and stuff. So we also have needing space. I don't know how to tell you I need some space without hurting your feelings. So this person, um, maybe they became too clingy or maybe they felt that about you. Maybe they felt like you got too clingy. Somebody here could be like Asian, Filipino, crazy rich Asian, uh, Filipino, Chinese, uh, Asian, whatever the case may be. Because I see that. I see that. The beautiful women beautiful men right god i envy their skin their skin and their hair all right let's see what else do we have here yeah somebody was always like they wanted you on their arm 24 7 or you want to always be with them because you love them or whatever and maybe they weren't used to that type of affection and it's just like i don't know how to tell you that i need space like back the fuck up without hurting your feelings yeah somebody was too sensitive that's why they couldn't tell you or you couldn't tell them that someone needed space because it's like you tell them anything and they're weeping weeping too sensitive they were too sensitive or you were and then here is this constantly catching them or you acting strange so this would be this would link up to the whole like going on you know double dates and then they're acting strange or giving each other the little googly eyes with the other person, the other person's date. And it's just like, uh, you, you guys want to fuck right here in front of me? Like, I'm right here. Like, maybe that's that's the deal. That's what something went down like that. Um, so, yeah, it apply it to your situation. Does it always have to, like, the whole thing, does it have to resonate just like little parts of it does? Take what resonates, drop what doesn't. What else do we have here? Way too immature. Maybe they felt like you were way too immature, acted silly. Maybe you were just someone that had a big sense of humor. You know, you were very humorous. Maybe they just thought and mistaken that for immaturity because they were just like too serious. Somebody was the polar opposite. Like one was way too serious and the other one was like, ah, 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 ah. and they mis you know, took that as immaturity. And you're just like, you're boring with your stiff tie and your fucking stoic face you know so it's like it mm, did, it just didn't work out because of that um so what else what other issues this is my issues deck you can find it in my Etsy shop so you're making me high I love that pause for Tony Braxton oh I want it. 
feeling something. <laughs> All right, we have the homies. Too much time with the homies. Uh, maybe you felt like this person, oh, this links up to the whole clingy thing. Okay, so maybe they wanted to spend time with the homies and, or you with your friends, you know, roles can be reversed and the other person's like clinging on. And it's like, I'm spending a lot of times with the homies because I need my space and you're, oh, you always want to cuddle or you always want to be right there. And the other person was always trying to get away. That's hurtful. It's hurtful. So yeah, someone was putting their homies or their friends before the connection and it didn't work out. Uh, what else? Vibe killer knows how to lower your energy and happiness assassin. Kills your vibes. Do you ever, you see what I'm saying? This links up to the way too immature card. So again, one's really serious and stoic and you're like feeling the vibe, dancing, acting silly, la 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 la, being a fucking menace or whatever. And they're just like so serious and giving you the eye, rolling their eyes and just like, you're like, why do you, why you gotta do that? Why you gotta ruin the fucking vibe? So maybe you didn't like that. Fucking vibe killer, you know? It's like smile a little bit, fuck. <laughs> can't stand people like that all right what do we have we have too soon somebody fell in love too fast someone you know said i love you too fast someone just it was too much too fast it's too quickly some people know what they want instantly others it, it takes time and if you're not on the same page with that it could be really difficult and it, be, it can become very hurtful we have kiss and tell Gossips about what happens within the connections and runs their mouth. You could be somebody that likes to kiss and tell and tell your homies like, oh my God, bitch, like guess what he did? Guess what she did? Whatever the case may be. And then this person's like, keep shit to yourself. And it makes you feel like, why? Why can't I talk about it? I'm excited about you. And you're like, are you hiding a fucking family? Do you have a second family? And you're jumping to conclusions. This person's like, no, I'm just private. But it made you really suspicious on why you couldn't like post all you know post them take pictures with them and you're somebody that likes to you know like take a selfie post this is my boo what's up and they were like the total opposite so that like kind of ruined it for you or them guess who's back in the motherfucking house see heartbreaker just came on see Mar can't come through mariah we have disconnected, um, hard time bonding mentally and emotionally detached. You just had a hard time bonding with each other. Mm. You try, if, if it really feels like someone really did try to bond, but if there's no connection and you're just disconnected or just together out of looks, pride, ego, whatever status, it's going to be boring as shit. It's not going to not gonna go anywhere so and see no chemistry lack of chemistry and missing the spark you see that will get you, that's enough to stay fucking disconnected so those are just a few things that could have happened let's get into my what's the news deck the star you go and break my heart you need someone to give you some real love right to give you some real I need somebody. We have an attempt to get him. Ooh, somebody was attempting to get your person right in front of you. See, it could have been like, see, this is why you have to be careful who you hang out with, who you party with. Because it's a, if a bitch fights with her dude and she's onto your man, she'll try, to, she'll try an attempt to get your person. Now, if your person is weak and they allow this up, themselves to be taken, then he needs to fucking go too. It's all about self control, right, and respect. Okay, we also have, wow, confused man wasting your damn time. Somebody didn't know what they wanted. They could have had a whole ass fiance or family. I love that movie, The Holiday. And wasted your damn time. Always made you feel like they were going to leave the other person and never happened. And we also have doing better without his ass. So somebody here could be pressed because they see you. They also see you as a privileged woman or whatever. You could, you could be independent. And they see that you're doing actually way better mentally, financially, and emotionally without their asses. And they're pissed off. We also have don't want it if it's that easy. So maybe they thought it was just too, too easy. Anyways, that's what's coming through. 